another night of delivery. We're gonna head back to see Linda and Kitty. Meow. All right, headed to Target. I always feel honoring thy mother and thy father it means taking care of yourself and honoring your own health because, you know, you came from your mother and your father. So I don't smoke cigarettes. I, I don't drink very rarely on a blue moon just to celebrate something maybe, you know, very rarely. Um, I don't drink on a daily basis at all, not alcohol. But that's a true way to, you know, becoming healthy and honoring your own your own body is a healthy way to honor thy mother and thy father. I wonder who really talks about that. I want to go in and get one of those Bolt House Farms. It's packed with vitamins and plenty of protein. Because watching out for my health is how I honor my mother and my father. I, I don't know if it's the right thing to do. I don't know if, it, if it's right to do, but I think in God's eyes it is, you know. Because any drug addict or any evil person can go be real nice to their mother and father and then go off and hurt themselves. And that's not honoring thy mother and thy father. It's in everything that you do. It's in your actions. All right, I'm gonna go get something healthy to drink. And it's good to see you. This is what I get sometimes to get uh, extra vitamins. And um, it's mostly, if I'm not mistaken, I think it's mostly milk. Because I've looked at it before here. It does contain reduced fat milk. You know, like cane sugar, soy protein concentrate, whey protein concentrate. But it's packed with a whole list of vitamins. Here's kind of like a quick wrap of the vitamins right here. So you've got you see at the top, vitamin D, 40%, the right under, under, under that right there, if you look under the vitamin D, you're getting vitamin C at 190%. And then vitamin B12 at 190%, calcium's at 60%, and then zinc's 45, potassium's 30, magnesium's 45%. So it's good for building muscle and protein, plus you're getting good milk. It tastes pretty good. It's a little, it, it has a little kick of sugar in there, but I wish they would kind of lower that. The muscle milk has less sugar, but I, th I have a feeling that the Bolt House Farm is probably a little bit better for you. Let's give her a try. Mm. Mm-hmm. It's it's kind of creamy taste. I think there's there's some fat in it. A few grams of fat. Um. See about six grams of fat, but 30 grams of protein. So it's not bad, it's not bad at all. I support it. I want to say that it's uh, made in well, a place called Bolt House Farms. A US, it's US made. Patent in the U.S. Just says Bolt House Farms, wherever that's made. It's without recycling. Oh, yeah, it's California. It's Bakersfield. I've been there. I've been to Bakersfield. I've been to Bakersfield. My second wife had some family in the area. It's a lot of farmland and stuff. It's pretty good. Bolt House Farms, where you, where you can get a quick nutrition right here. Target, super, super target.
Looks like the new McDonald's is coming along. Oh, there's Kitty. Look at that Kitty. Yeah, it's a Kitty. Hey, sweetie. Um, oops, shoes. Um, there's another cat out there that looks like Skinny Midnight, but I don't think it's Skinny Midnight. Ooh, I like these. These are nice. Huh, that's really nice. Hey, sweetie. Walk through the bag. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's see it, let's see it, Rupert. Let's see it, yeah. Oh, I thought it was funny. Sorry, I thought it was funny. Where did you, why did you, that's from uh, a movie. I forgot the name of the movie. Yeah, the one with uh, Meg Ryan. There you go. Not Meg Ryan, uh, what's her name? Oh, yeah, name? Michelle Pfeiffer. Yeah, Michelle. Um, Dangerous Minds. There's it's Kitty. <laughs> Here we go with today's Kitty. One Kitty with nine lives. Each life has a number. Numbers one through nine. Let's swirl the camera. All right. Let's pick a cat food. Got one. Today's kitty will be having Sheba. Cuts and gravy with, what's this? Sustainable salmon. All right. The kitty's hungry. Let's get him a good bowl. Go. Or a little dish. We'll do a little dish. Let's open it right here. Ooh. Open it, open it. There we go. Here we go. Let's see if Kitty likes it. He really likes these Shebas. It's one of his favorites. Ooh. Sustainable salmon. Yeah, he really likes those sheep. Tonight, we're having Purdue chicken breast tenders. And I'm gonna dress up this nice New York slice right here. With some um, pepper, got some, this kind of pepper, and I'm gonna get some spinach. All right, so that's preheating for the chicken. And we're gonna get to this. So I'm gonna put everything on the pizza pan in one snap. It's gonna be the spinach some of this orange stuff, maybe a little bit of the red bell pepper and then more of the orange bell pepper. And here we go. All right, so we've got the bell pepper, the red pepper, and the spinach. I'm gonna add some of this cheese to it. Not a whole lot, just a little bit. Bake. Probably going to about 395. Check time. About eight minutes to see check on it. Oh! I just now remembered. Who's going to put it in the oven? Hi, everybody. I'm Mr. Maroney. I'm going to put the oven. I'm, whoops. I'm going to put the pizza in the oven. There we go. Hey, ventriloquism, ventriloquism, <laughs> Vent ventri I'm a ventriloquist, a ventriloquist, there we go. Right, right in there, got it. All right. You found it. Yeah, there's Linda the cook. Hey. All right. Did you preheat it? Uh, yeah, it was preheated. Delicious air fryer. It is okay. preheated, yeah. And we will put the chicken tenders in there. Oh, there we Come go. Here, right, right. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, cool. Is that enough for you? Awesome. Right, we can share them. Let's share get, get some ketchup. Ooh, cool. You don't use ketchup with chicken tenders. So how tenders. much do you put it in there? Seven minutes. Seven minutes. They're already pre-cooked. So. Air fried. Yeah. Right, Maroonie, it's time to do your job. Yay, I get to take the pizza out. 
I'm also a ventriloquist. See? I'm talking like that. All right. Now it's time for the pizza. Let's turn the oven off. Here we go. melted pizza. Look at those bell peppers and spinach and melted cheese. Boy, that looks great. All right, let's see the buoyancy of the scoop. That looks pretty good. Pretty good scoop. I'm putting this over here. Ooh. And right when I end it, turn that off. Ooh. Hoo, 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 hoo. Double feature on this baby. That's some chicken strips for Linda and I. And I have some Got some uh, pizza just in case, so my tummy will be full. Tried a few slices of that and put some uh, ranch on it. It was really good. Mmm. Now I'm gonna get to the chicken stuff in a minute. Pretty good pizza. All right. So we got these. I'm gonna get the tongs for the. All right. So these are really crisp when you cook them in the air fryer. I'm going to do like three of them. All right, we're going to get a few more out for Linda. Did you want to try mine? Of course I do. Another one over here. These air fryers are, they just, they're magnificent with the chicken strips. Did you want to use the, the ketchup? I still knew, but can I sauce? Would you like me to have? All right, Linda's going to try this out with some water burger ketchup. Here we go. Mmm. Is that good? It looks good. I'm going to try it too. Here. All right, so mine, I got like three strips right here. I just put it in the microwave. I am going to use the ketchup too. No air but fryer. Air fryer? Yeah, I'll put it in the air fryer. I just heated it up in the, I'm gonna use a little bit of this right here. Sorry to magic tricks tonight, I'm gonna give it a try. Thank you, Lord, for the food. Hmm, that Purdue is good. Y'all have a good night. You kitty cute. Cute, 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 cute.
Thank you.